Alrighty guys, welcome back to episode of NBA 2K14. Today we are headed to the stadium. Looks like we're going to be going up against the uh, the Utah Jazz. So here we go. We've got some tweets here. Derek Favors says, I know you like to drop them from deep, but I'm shutting you down tonight. Think you can knock down three threes? I mean, that's going to be easy, bro. I don't even have to think about that one. Uh, Alex Kennedy says, uh, Trevor was simply imposing out there tonight. He was getting his hand in the way of everything, probably altering even more shots than the three actually blocked. Yeah, we were a freaking swatting machine in that last game. Uh, finally given a chance to start for the Pistons. Should be interesting to see his, uh, his progress moving forward. Uh, swatting machine. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We were a swatting machine, bro. We're on the same, uh, the same page there. Um, don't look down. 21 says, gotta wonder what the Pistons are thinking starting a young guy like Trevor already. Let the kid develop slowly. Whoa, get out of here, bro. Are you kidding me? Have you seen my game? You obviously have not been looking. Anyway, uh, nice. Looks like the Pistons are celebrating at Trevor being started by putting up a new billboard downtown. Hearing from stores in the Pistons organization that Trevor will be interested in starting lineup sooner rather than later. Something to keep an eye on for sure. Uh, cool. So, people are, uh, are pretty excited about uh, about me being a starter. We're, uh, we're definitely running through opponents like we've... Uh, We've come to uh, to be accustomed with for the past, uh, I don't know, 10 games or so. And and things are looking good, so let's keep it up. We're going to be going up against the Jazz here, and let's, um, let's continue on this streak of dominance. We've got some terrific NBA action. Hell yeah, here we go, guys. This We've got the Utah Jazz against the Detroit Pistons, Pistons baby. Now we're at home, and it's time guys, to take, take on these what mother truckers. Thanks yeah, for getting this. Darren Williams no longer plays with them. We're going to have to go up against them tonight. This should be a pretty easy win. Looks like we win the opening tip. Go ahead and give the ball. I'll dime it down to Andre Jumming and start it off with the six. Hell yeah, that's how we start the game, baby. Fast. It's not just for All show right, I need him. to get off to a good it's shot, get some easy looks, and knock down three and for the crowd. We'll of your first Utah. four shots. This, okay, this one's one of the more difficult ones, too, but let's going just make great. sure we take some more shots, have been and we should fellas. be good to go. You know, they've looked a bit lost out there lately. The only I mean, thing about this challenge is it makes me second-guess taking threes. Sometimes threes seem a little bit... You've got to make things happen. Yeah, a little bit random in terms of they, they go in or not. Confidence. And sometimes when you do that, you end up forcing plays. Uh, so it's a, a delicate balance. You know, they have to regain some confidence. With Let's run that pick and roll. Effort. Hell yeah. I think things will turn, but it's going to take some, some work. Here's Monroe after the main shot from Garrett. There it is. That's one for one, baby. Woohoo! Solid. A little give and go there. Pick and roll followed by the give and go. That worked. Flawlessly. They come in off a loss to the Spurs in San Antonio. Yeah, they were really in a funk from the field. Guys, credit the defense. Definitely. Ooh, look at that good shot defense. Almost got the rebound, too. Give me the ball. Hey, Let's hey, go down. Me and you uh, flub up words uh, and three city. Boom. Well, That's two for two, baby. <laughs> yeah. What a good start. He could have a big game if they Let's go. Him up more tightly on the perimeter. Already up so seven to two. That was a, uh, a pretty quick hey, turn of events, huh? I do say so myself. Let's get a steal here and then take it down coast to coast for a Dishes score. It to Burks. Ooh. Out to the right it's not going to work. Three -pointer. Hayward. Shot is off. ourselves a re. And it's Detroit the other up way. to Chauncey. Ooh. We come into this having outplayed Phoenix the last game. trying to get it out to Chauncey. Had to admire the versatility they showed offensively that day. Yeah, their scoring came from all over the place. If one approach... Look at that. Oh, no! no I wanted the assist. For you, Damn it, that would have been like the best start to a game we've ever had. We would have... Well, you know, that coming right out of UConn, guys, there were some concerns about Andre Drummond's motor and work ethic, passion for Locking the game. foul on Drummond. He really quickly dispelled those with his tremendous production. This was a guy who played with great energy and effort. All right, come on, let's keep it up. Just about every time I saw him. Here is Hayward. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against the Spurs in San Antonio. Well, he was aggressive oh. at both ends of the floor. He had three steals. That court by damn it. Yeah. yeah. I had no clue that was going to be going to the back. I couldn't tell where that pass was going, but I should have chased that down. If we would have had a little bit better reaction time there, we totally could have had an enormous or Detroit, they've gone monster the slam the down the field of the game. court. See, we're talking about the motor for Andre Drummond per minute among very top rebounders in the game. Well, he moves like a guard, Kevin. It's almost surreal to, to watch the way he kind of floats around the court. For such a there it is. <laughs> Starting off strong. You guys see that little pump fake there? Get him off the bus. We're 3 age, for 3. Upside is really off Seven the points. Now let's go over to Doris Burke, who's we're going off with Tyrone Corbin. 
we discussed their game plan defensively, and he mentioned that controlling. How do we Greg not steal that? We were right in that He's passing lane. I don't understand. Oh well, good hands well, there. And his passing good stuff, really T. sets him apart. Their offense runs best when it goes through his hands. So pressuring him and staying vigilant is essential for us. Guys, can they slow him down? And thank you for that, Doris. Just five. How am I leaving my assignments? I'm just guarding the passing lane. Here's Hayward. Ooh. Pass to Garrett. He kicks to Favors. And Billups over to help. All righty, come on, guys. Here's Garrett. Let's not let them Favors get a bunch of screen. second chance points. That's how you Here's lose the basketball feet to games. Inside to Favors. Kind of oh wow, he missed minutes, it. Guys. My Five God, how four, many ten, times are they going to get a rebound? Base. Jesus. He's a grinder. All right, here we go. He does under the offensive boards, really bringing energy and life to his team. Outside, Martin. Martin gets a screen from Monroe. Supposed to drive to the basket, Greg. That's not a good drive, buddy. The basket drops. Oh well, I guess I'll take the end one. That's one free throw coming his way. So far, so good for them at the offensive end here in the early going. Boy, the field goal percentage Ugh. is fantastic. I guess I won't. Exactly the kind of start they were hoping for. Boy, guys, I love the growth that Greg Monroe has shown in his first three years in the league. It's been slow and steady, but that's the I kind keep of forgetting how you young Greg Monroe is. I know that I've said that better, before, but it never... Highly skilled. When they keep saying and three years in the league, it just seems like it's so much longer than him, that. The last game against the Spurs in San Antonio. And he gave great effort defensively as well, including a couple of block shots. This is his first free throw of the game. That dude has a very awkward free throw shot. That made me really uncomfortable to watch. He said he's comfortable playing at either position. That's a great thing to have, that type of versatility on the front line. Because Look at that behind the back pass. Teams are going to break down a little bit. Getting foul trouble. Pick left. Oh, why would you pick on that side, dude? What are you doing? Flexibility. It's a huge asset. Now, here is Mark. Coming off a solid outing against Phoenix. Here's Monroe. The <laughs> tenth of the target. Is that a hook over the backboard? First of the game for the Jams. Oh my chance God! The for them to go up against this Pistons team. This may not be an opponent they're overly familiar with. All right, here we go. With, What's up, Burks? Uh, didn't stop them from winning both of the games they played last year. Let's catch up with Doris from the sideline. Yes, during that break, Coach Maurice Cheeks had some words for his team. He wants this game played at breakneck pace as much as possible. He was very clear, saying the Break fast neck break pace. I like that. I can handle that. Today. His other point of emphasis was that they need to be yeah. sharp. Kind of left my assignment the there, but that's all right. Operating their offense out of the low post. Guys, we'll just have to watch how it plays out here in the first half. Kevin, back to you. All right, Doris. Now Monroe, following Alec Burks's three-point attempt. Martin with it. Now guarded by Hayward. Martin kicks wide Smith. open. Smith. Oh, Smith, Smith you got to hold on to that, Be buddy. Prince with the steal. Now Hayward, looking for his first basket still on this one. No luck. Nice. And they forced the miss with that good defensive rotation. They're playing well Let's together. See you, Chance. Phillips dishes to Martin. Got him. Wow. No How do we not knock that? We couldn't have been more shot. open. He has to knock down. Smooth finish. Good transition well, defense. I'll take it. One on the end of those breaks. He always. I have no strong. clue how we didn't knock down that shot. He dishes it to Monroe. Ooh, look at that. By wow. Guys, come on. We had such a good start. Nobody's making possession. anything now. Yeah, I'm missing wide open shots, and none of my teammates are holding it down. got to find something. You're right. Kicks to Beatrice. Passes it to Burks. There's the what? three. Rebound by Monroe. Freaking switched players on me, bro. Got four rebounds in this game. Who do I want to hit? Outside, Mark. Smith sets the pick for Martin. Into Smith. There it is. Ooh, Josh. With the steal. Come on. How is that a turnover on my part, and the game? Pass to Hayward. Now the dish to Burks. Seriously, Jams he had his hands on the ball, and then he fumbled it and gave it to the Garrett, other the team. To Burks. It's stolen Look at that by steal. Martin. And now the Pistons fast break. Martin with the oh ball. my God! With the steal. And even that was free not free a break. sexy pass like I thought it was going to be. And Hayward gets it to go. Hayward's got All right, guys, come on, we got to step this up here. Well, they won't be down for long if they can get some more. Wow, coach took me out. Okay, we're back in the second quarter. 6:43 left. Here we go. By six. 
Guys, we got to step this up. When you think of the up. Detroit Pistons, you always think back to some of the big powerhouse championship teams of the late 80s or Ooh, early 2000s. When that they was, won titles as well. They, wow. I always didn't know you could hit, to contend hit the with side of the backboard in this game. Okay, interesting. Test here as they Learning experience, eh? Shooting guard. Andre Drummond is out there with Smith. Then it's Kyle Singer, and it's Siva in at the one. That's the group for Detroit right now. Oh, well, we're up to a B minus. Another season for Detroit. We're doing pretty good. Another year that their fans would like to forget. Steve, we need to start knocking down those open shots. My teammates season. need to start making it. It's not even our so fault. We're some shooting months. like that. Oh, for sure. But there's some good young talent. 60% from the floor, but our teammates are Smith. doing awful. This is a team that has plenty of ability, and they're trying to put it together now this year. Right, nice. And Reach Dennis Kanter picks up the foul. And that'll be his third foul so far. On defense, the Jazz, trailing by four. Martin with it, now guarded by Garrett. Yeah. The offensive rebound, Drummond. Definitely three thought we were to be able to bank it off the backboard right there. Those are usually pretty Jazz solid shots. Oh, well. Three from the field here to open the second quarter. And Garrett kicks okay. to Burks. We're going to focus, guys. I'm down to a 50% field goal percentage. Oh, that's a lot better than we had to start the last Burks. game. That one turned out okay. Pass to Cannon. Tries to save it. Woo. He kicks it to Hayward. Hits it from Wow. All right. Hayward's 22 to 23, guys. We're starting to fall apart. It is time for uh, for Trevor Martin to start taking over the game. Here we go. We're going to start taking over. Screen or somehow finds an opening. Start taking over, son. He's going to let that thing go. And here's another thing I've noticed. You know, sometimes the defensive the big man. man, he'll come out of nowhere to make a play on the ball. Blocking a shot from behind when the shooter had no idea he was there. A Take over. Check in with Let's go. Hi, guys. Over that break, I was able to catch the message Tyrone Corbin was giving to his team. He told his guys that they Oof. needed to be much more patient at the offensive Oof. end. Oof. How are we not jacking his cookies right there? Bad shot selection. Was almost had that pass too. Oh, he the almost game. missed it. All right, well, here we go. Up by two. We'll Give me the ball. Nobody going to guard me? Okay. You, I'll knock it down. Oh, come on. Game. You got to give me those. He was not guarding me at all. Now, here's Burks. Defense is right there. Feeds it to Garrett. Lock at six. And Utah again like with the bus. Surprised to be that wide open yet. Here he we go. It down. I see you, Andre. Roman dishes to Martin. This one. Gotta guard three. me, son. Wow! How are we missing so many shots? I don't understand. I really don't get it. Out of his rhythm. Right back to the basics it's there, like, using the one-hand slam. For it's that been for the last couple of episodes. We're exciting. like we're yeah, wide does. open and we're missing shots. Well, I mean, he should stay with those basics in a tight ball game because uh, we've got one here tonight. Detroit with the ball. It just doesn't. I don't, it doesn't click with me. I don't get it. Nice. Now, this Good pass. Detroit okay, that's what we need. For plays just like that. Well, he almost brought we the need to get the crowd hyped up because yeah, he did. Well, things are not looking too good. Also, a great game we've got here. And there's the feed to Cantor. Works with it. He's against Mark. Nice Burks try to drive him, his son. I got that lockdown D, though. The Jazz need to get off a shot here. Wow. And again, it's wow. The Oh, wow, guys, doesn't look good. We've got an injury here. Yeah, from the look on his face, he's in a lot of pain. Was that the shooter? Yeah, it sure looks that way. He's, he got hurt? He's going to come out of the game right now and get uh -oh. that thing checked out. Uh, That's not good. I don't wish, wish harm on anybody. No, I was trying to bash it down low to the big man. All right. Ooh. Usually Josh is willing to dish it to me when I'm down low. Good move. Martin's got five points now this quarter. They Lean right into him. The there we go. Inside in the first half, guys, and it's paid dividend. Yeah, it sure has, Clark. I mean, with, with as many points as they've gotten in the paint, they really haven't had to do much on the perimeter. Oh, here's Jefferson. He's got six. With that perfect help defense. He dishes it to Hayward. To the right side. Here's Garrett. Oh my gosh, so guys! You can't let the them drive in at the last second and then foul. Call there. No question about They're that. getting sloppy, and then you guys are rewarding them. Come on now. 
haven't seen them miss a shot from the line in this quarter, so they're doing a nice job of protecting the lead. Well, they're cashing in from the line. I mean, they're making them pay for fouling them right was now. About to pull up for the three Morgan right there. Didn't want to, Evans though. Checked in. Martin, the best to Monroe. Unloads Back him down, nine. bro. Hell and yeah. Detroit Hit him with a little fader. I like it. 32-32. I just want to keep the uh, point attempts to go down here in the second quarter. Be a drink, just keep three. the lead at the half. Nice Smith. steal, Josh. Yo, Greg. Monroe dishes the Billups. Wow. Outside, Mark. So the foul nice. The okay. Two free throws for the Saw an opportunity right to cut and I did it. Ineffective in this one. Just no slowing down for Slightly Martin. late. 12 Ooh. points and he's knocked down a pair of three pointers in this game too. Well, they might want to think about setting a few more screens for him too. Wow. Oh my gosh. If we would have went 0 for 2, that would have been awful. One for two is okay. 0 for two is completely unacceptable. Great. 7 of 8 from the floor. You know, you look at the flex offense that Utah utilizes, and it requires Stay that players, one, lane. be versatile and multi-skilled, but also that they have good basketball IQ. You need to be able to screen and read Tip defenses pass. effectively. And uh, that's not easy, but it's certainly a good way to play. If they the knocked right it down on us. All right, we are down by two. Minute 32 now. left in the quarter. Well, they should be and winning. And Shooting the ball like that. This is a very efficient offense we're seeing out of this club. Now, here is Mark. He's got 13. Shit. Stole it Mark. back, though. Let's go. When you fall down, get the hell back up. Good stuff. All right. Man, we got blocked. Stole that shit right back and took it to the hoop. I will take that. Steve, that's not going to cut it in the flex. No, it keeps you moving. Foul on the tome. The ball going. Can't keep giving these free throws, guys. It's a great offense, and it's difficult to I was cover. not expecting like this much uh, it resistance from this team. It teaches the young players how to play as well. Doesn't it always seem like that, though? Yes, I have the teams Josh that we expect Smith to be really Josh good aren't now, really like we, we had a major blowouts sprint. on teams that I was really worried about playing before. So the weekend is kind of interesting. Oh well, 15 points in the first night, half, one rebound, one assist. Sprint. We aren't quite Half-time having the game we had yesterday, but by sprint. hey, most of the stuff came from the second half yesterday, so we'll see. Well, both sides We're still doing pretty good. They need to do over the break. I'm excited to have, have a close we'll game. Okay, I need to focus on taking care of the, the ball. Quarter. I want to see another turnover the rest of this quarter. Okay, coach, I got you. An son. Impressive effort here today. I got you. Well, in terms of his points in the first half, I mean that's pretty go. much what we've come to expect out of him. Yeah, that's an open book on all you need to know about what talent he has. I'll bet he adds a lot more to that tally we in the second this. half. We got this. Okay, time now for an injury report. Jesus, guys. Doris Too many to You guys are going to start fouling out. Doris. Kevin, I chatted Seriously. briefly with the head athletic trainer for the Jazz. Right now, he said it looks like a severely right, sprained be down by ankle, one. something every player hates to hear. A return in this one is out of the question. Let's keep and pressing now. on the shelf for a long time. All right, Doris. Really appreciate you finding out how he's doing. Yeah, let's keep our fingers crossed. Uh-oh, reach and foul. Okay, cool. Court soon. We'll take it. It's a tough process, Steve, and if any luck for him, it'll be a short one. So on the floor for Riggs, you. Oh, no! He was wide open! Shit! The and there goes my play it smart challenge. And Garrett, and it's Clark, and it's he was wide goal. open, but now we couldn't quite Doris sneak Burke. the pass Doris. in there. Thanks, guys. Mr. Clutch, in their last game against the Suns, played some outstanding basketball. He finished with 34 points, and an extra bonus from him as he really showed up on the defensive end, adding quite a few steals. It was a performance for the ages, and one that will have the A performance for the ages, huh? Oh, <laughs> she really liked my game. Girl, I'll hook up with you after the game. I'd say no chance, partner. Later tonight. It's not a knock against him. It's just that he was so good that night. I don't think he can possibly do it two games in a row. He was Kelloggian. <laughs> I really, we were talking to, uh, like, I don't know if it was last episode, maybe the one before that, how I hope that they have more, uh, oh, nice backcourt violation. I hope that they have more cuts in the next game. More personalized, personalized cuts and things like that. I also hope that they have uh, more announcer talk. And we've got some we're hearing the same stuff over and over. It's starting to get old. Yeah, you're talking the elites of the game when you go down that list. Interesting to see a, a new Jesus, stat. dude. Kind of thought I saw an open. I thought dead I was going to help us out there. It didn't really yeah, do the, much, the though. The rankings obviously make sense. Good shot defense. I'll take it. Gotta love the finger roll up All right, we're down by three. Defense. Let's this start making stuff happen. Three. We've been playing like an idiot. Guys, they're looking for a way to score Ooh, here. look at yeah, that. they've had a tough time getting the lead Perfect. off the basket so far. 
okay. that's the kind of aggressive Let's just start making things happen. We've been forcing shots. We've been uh, no just question. being an idiot Pounded teammate. We're going to start, and continue to start applying on ourselves. That defense. Kicks it to Garrett. We're going to play good defense on our man. He's definitely not going to score. We're going to try to play healthy Cast for our teammates. Terrific Oof. assist. A nice finish. Solid play all around. All right, still down by three. Nothing but money for him to start the half. They've made all three of their shot attempts. Now here is Martin, covered by Clark. Driving dish out. Kicks to Smith. That didn't really Outside work out. Martin. Just five on the clock. Here's Monroe. Nice. And Detroit again with the bucket. Way to get Monroe big, bro. That's what we right need. All right, let's get a stop, guys. Three of their first four attempts. Oof. Almost got that ball right there. Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. Oof, almost got it right there, too. Passes to Hayward. There's the double team with Martin. Garrett, the pass to Cannon. From 12 feet out, up again. Oh, the Favors. dip slam. Favors got that was not, the three not pretty. The Coming out strong here in the third quarter. That's four for five shooting for this team. Their turnaround jumper. Woo! Hell yeah, Greg. He's going man. big right now. And that's 12 Just like we need him to. Okay, here we go. I'm trying to do some give and this goes, but nobody's biting on them. Shit. Guys, without posting the winning record, and they're Shit. on their fourth coach Floater, man, 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 man. That's my fault. Bench. Hopefully, they'll be able to find some stability there and some improvement on the court. And it's Martin penetrating. Oh, this we missed our shot. Short. What the fudge, dude? Jazz leading we almost three. got a steal right down at the end, too. Out to the wing. Oh. Garrett dishes to Cantor. I can't believe we missed that a easy J. shot Held right under the basket. Back okay, the here we go. And we get that over. The rebuild has hurt attendance. There's no doubt about that. It's dropped over 20% over the last decade. Down around 67% last season. Woo! Look at that. <laughs> A little behind the back handoff. That was beautiful. Good stuff. Shit. Wow. Holy fudgel sticks. That was a dirty block. I realized I was not between my man and the basket. Freaked out. Went up behind him and just SWAT city, bitch. Swat city, bitch. Swat, swat city, bitch. Jefferson against Martin. Look at this lockdown, Jefferson D. kicks to Evans. Got a piece of it. Stolen by Martin. Watch these quick hands, homie. Ooh. Can't keep up with me. Martin with it. Pick and roll. He's got 17. Into Smith to the left wing. Six to shoot. Oh, fudge, guys. That was our opportunity to take the lead, and we just blew it. You dumbasses are trying to take stupid shots. <laughs> You're looking like me. Ooh. And Beatrich kicks to Garrett. He feeds it to Evans. We have to shoot soon. Here's Garrett. He's got seven. Rejected by Martin. Yes. Now Detroit moving it up. It's Shit. Shit. Leaps for it. Oh my god. For the lead. Oh, oh, good thing we knocked that down. I would have killed myself. I was gonna take it myself, and then I decided to pass it, and by that time it was too late. So I was like, oh man, that was just awful. Something that's also been. If we would have knocked that down, I would have never forgiven myself. The turnovers they forced and the points that have come along with those forced turnovers. Hayward dishes to Beatrice. And it's sent Look at this! Drummond. Wow, he tried to grab it too, out of bounds on the Jazz. Now we have a chance okay, we're up by one. 234 left in the third. Let's slow it down, boys. Fourth, the Pistons. Seems like their whole team is in a great rhythm from the three-point line right now. They've put on a display from long range. Martin kicks to Drummond. Slow and it down. Martin. Ooh, don't go back for it. Wow, that was close. Martin gets a screen from Smith. Martin goes in. 
Nice. A look at some of the stats for I'll Gordon take it in and draw the foul. Here we go. Let's knock these down, recently. Trev. Come on. You can put his Feel your inner the basketball player. Fifth and three point shooting. Slightly early, okay? Just a little bit after, which is just let it go on. Play passing lanes. He ranks among the top 15 okay. in the league in steals per game. Oh, that's not yeah, bad. And, you know, taking a look again at his three-point shooting, Steve, he's done an two excellent two. job, I think, of finding open spots. His teammates help him get open, but he understands how to do that. Shit, and then shit, he shit. Just I hate when we go for the steals, Lucas, and then I end up behind the defender. You can go for a steal, but you don't have to go George balls to deep for a steal they like that, Trev. One. They've got the Wizards ahead of them for the next game. It's in Washington. That'll be just one game played away from home for them. Some good matchups Put it up there. there. Nice. Washington Wizards. Hell yes. Definitely good shit, man. I can go over there and pick you up off the ground. I totally well would. Homie. Second chance points for him. You know, Josh Smith is one of the last guys you want to see in the open court if you're a defender. I mean, when he's coming at you to slam it on you and uh -oh. you're backpedaling and looking over your shoulder. This is just a, uh, oh, man, an offensive a scary, showcase scary here. Feeling. We score, they score. We score, they score. That's all that's Lucas going on right Mark. now. Dishes it to Smith. Bad shot. shot oh. he lays another it offensive rebound and another Smith's putback for Smith. For Two possessions in a row. That's, that's awesome. Good job, bro. He gets to the bucket. For Utah, they've gone seven of twelve from the floor since coming out of the break. Well, Steve, back to Smith—a great combination of quickness and strength and leaping ability. Yeah, he moves like a small forward, but can finish. Yo, how did I not grab that in this league? So when he gets ahead of steam in transition, you better watch out. Shot clock at three. All Crash the boards. Woo! From Garrett. Let's go. Distance All right, slow it down. Three. 40 seconds left. Let's make sure that we get this ball back and they're not the last ones with the ball. Now, here is Martin. He's got 21. He kicks it to Smith. Back to Martin. Oh! How do we not slam that right there? I, can, I don't think it's possible for us to If you guys have any clue why we wouldn't be able to dunk, you could we upgraded that, our see, dunk all the way, and it never lets us dunk. Enough down low. It's a four-second differential between the shot clock and game clock. Williams kicks to Gary. Here we go. Outside Jefferson. We could get a stop here. That would be so the huge. working the ball around now. Here's Garrett. Rebound by the Pistons. He's far too tentative in the paint, and even more so when the defender is up tight on him like that time. Woo! <laughs> we almost... It and wouldn't let me go up and hold the ball. It pressed square and immediately, it immediately let it go. It wouldn't let me actually take my jumper. So that sucks. And Steve, we've got a There's no way we're going to make that shot. Oh, well. We're still doing pretty well. Oh, we're starting off the fourth quarter on the bench. Coach, what do you think? I'm going in against Gordon Hayward. Ah, uh, man, we're up by one. Okay. They've got the ball. We're hot on D. Now Cantor. Here we go. Let's let's shut this team down, baby. So the wing on the left. It's stolen by Martin. Oh yeah. Josh That's Smith the way to start it. The three and four. I was about to pull up there. I was scared there. he was gonna Plus. steal it and though. It's Drummond in at the five. That's the five on the four for the Pistons. Three pointer. Martin. Oh! Slightly late. To keep it alive. Damn it. How is that a turnover? I missed the shot. That's not a turnover. Utah game. Jazz. At the conclusion of this game, I was so Minnesota open that it made me nervous. The That'll be <laughs> like, the last seriously. Game of their very short I held it for too long because I was so open. I was like, wait a second. What's Utah's going on here? Why am I so open? Point I shouldn't get this the open. Fourth. Here's Garrett. Outside Jefferson. Game, you can't, you can't keep switching defenders on me like this. That's ridiculous. But through the teeth of some pretty soft D, I can't help but say that. Well, let's see how that impacts things here. Because those kinds of plays sometimes can be game changers on both sides. Come on, Bill. Woo! Clutch. That was big. Okay, up by two. That was huge. Bill, if I'm going to be honest, I don't like you all that much, but... That was a big play, Favors my man. You deserve a pat on the back. Oh, we're, we're switching here. I'm, I'm now on a big man. This is not a good thing. This is a definite mismatch. Damn it! <laughs> what am I supposed to do? I wasn't going to go touch his back because he's just going to back me down like it was nothing. But you know, you just know what this guy 
He's always ready to turn it around. That's yes. Good. And that's enormous. Points for Mark. And e freaking enormous. Time here. They're committing an awful lot of fouls. And most of them are unproductive. Here we go. Two minutes left in the fourth. Up by two. Could turn into a parade to the foul line. Doris Burke has an update for us. Doris. Hi guys. Over that break, I was able to catch the message Tyrone Corbin was giving to his team. He said, "No time to waste." Fellas. Shit. Okay. Tie game. 155 right now, left. Make a comeback and try to win this thing. Let's I'm nervous, man. Back to you. Detroit's gonna if I told you guys I wasn't nervous, I'd be lying. Oh, I needed to go big there, and the I game. failed my team. Misses God damn it. Range. Why do I and always Jefferson. miss mother trucking layups? Seriously. We need to work on our close range game. Number one priority as soon as this freaking game is over. Here's Garrett. To Jefferson, he dishes it to Hayward. No way he knocks that down. I was gonna say. Monroe's got rebound number eight here tonight in the game. Very right, we're gonna slow it down here. For him behind the arc today, just one three-pointer in the first half, and still none in the second. Martin, the basket. Oh, let's go! I knew that was gonna work. I knew that was gonna work. Let's go, baby. Good shit. Here we go. Yeah, very nice set play. Now it's time to lock him down. Clark, he's checked in for Jefferson. Clark dishes to Garrett. Oh, man. Dude, I'm starting to get that Inside feeling in my stomach, face. dude. Holy shit. I'm, I'm, like, legitimately nervous. Oh, I want to win this game so bad. We've taken quite a few more poor more shots. They could have easily been the decision the makers of this game. And Unbelievable. Sure why his How did you not hold on to that? the ball at every opportunity. I mean... The way he's going out there, let him have it every trip. How do we not? A crucial basket. They needed it. Three pointer, really? How did he not hold on to that? And then and how did we us. not steal that? Martin from outside. Got him! Let's go! Holy shit! That was not the best shot in the world to take. But we totally just knocked that down in that dude's face. Five seconds separating the shot and game blocks. Garrett. Rebounded by Hold that mother trucking ball and Detroit's give it to me. The arc seven times Yo, the I want the ball. I want the ball. 82-82. Martin with it. In low to Monroe. Take it! Woo! Assist to win the game, baby. We just gotta play defense. Holy shit. Here's Garrett. Oh, he had a Good shot. I I just totally stopped that shot from going in like that. I was the only person on that man. And he wasn't even mine. Oh my gosh. What a nail biter, guys. That one went down right to the final seconds, and my heart is literally hurting in my chest right now because I was nervous about losing that game. So congratulations, that was a good one. The ones that make me uh make me really try my balls off are the ones that I enjoy the most. Thanks for watching guys, catch you all later. Jordan presents See you in the next episode. Peace out. Mr. Clutch.